Zebra Herd, welcome back to Starlink Battle for Atlas. Today, we are tackling some outer space shenanigans today. We're going to be trying to take on some of the, oh, wrong button. Uh, we're trying to take on some of these dreadnoughts and hoping it turns out okay, because they're making things a lot more difficult than it has to be by sending in primes constantly, making it really hard to catch up with most things. No matter how hard I just try to keep going, things keep kicking our butts. So I'm hoping this will help. Well, I guess we'll have to wait and see for ourselves. If it doesn't, then I don't know what to say. <laughs> I mean, we could start tackling some other lower level opponents like the 15 to 20 here and the 10 to 15 here. Because that actually, that used to sound really difficult. Warning. That sounds like a walk in a Incoming park now. Hyperspace trap. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and try to dodge this trap as much as possible. You really got a nosedive for that one. We That's sort of baloney. How in the world? I wasn't even the tra trajectory I was going. I mean, I guess it's a, a trap. That's the point. Where even are they? I can't see them. That there they are. Hurt. I think I'll change this to this. Yeah, that should work. We'll see about that. I mean, maybe this wouldn't be smart. Maybe it would be smarter to do this, just because that way we can, oh, that's the flamethrower, this one. <laughs> Sorry, I know I sound very undecided here, but that's not the problem. It's just, you need to actually select the proper weapon. So these are level 18 outlaws. We're also level 18, so that's pretty cool. Go ahead and try to destroy this guy as much as we can. Oh, destroy him. Once we actually aim up on him. I mean, this fighting in a third dimension, instead of it being usually, I mean, I know it's typically three dimensional, three dimensional battles, but now they can be like any up and down below or above you, you know? It can be really tough. We seem to have captured their attention. Well, actually we just captured their destruction or something. Am I going the right way? I believe I am. I'm picking up some wreckage near your position. Might be worth checking out. Yeah, it might be worth just getting rid of it real fast. Get this heat cache, bust it, and that might actually spawn in some guys who will attack me. I don't really know how that works. But we got some uh, cool stuff for it. So that's all I care for. Keep moving. We're gonna go ahead and take on this dreadnought. Before I tried to ask Carl a little bit in the last episode, we got our butt kicked, though. So it didn't really work too well. But we'll see how this works. Legion dreadnought. Hyperdrive disabled. Warning. Yep. Dreadnought defense is engaged. Prepare for battle. So it wouldn't be the first time we've successfully tackled something that's a little bit above our level. I can only hope that'll happen here. But I don't know. Hmm. Nothing's popping out yet. Oh, here they come, here they come. Yo, Spoke too here. soon. That thing's gonna wreck you. I don't know about that. Why can't you have at least some semblance of confidence in me? That'd be great. Thank you, Levi. Come on, keep going, keep going, keep going. So far, no damage taken, that's a really good sign. And we're taking care of guys left and right. Okay, now they're starting to pay attention to me a little bit more, and it hurts. I need to make sure this ship doesn't get taken out. So you know what? Let's go ahead and change it now, because I'd like to keep that ship for as long as possible. Because it's our best one. It has the best upgrades on it for right now. What just happened? That just, it just moved me. That was bizarre. I've never seen that happen before. That was super odd. Luckily, we do have some friends out here helping us to some extent. That's always good to see. As I guess the glowing green guys are our friends. And we're actually tearing these guys up. There we go. Need to get some health back. And then we're gonna move this way. There's one guy down this way. Come on, teammates. Help me out with that. Good job, good job. So what exactly are we gonna do now? Uh, yeah, where do we damage him? <laughs> I sort of forget how this works. There has to be something obvious somewhere. I mean, there are all the turrets on the top there. They're gonna be trying to shoot at me. I'm gonna be trying to shoot at them. Okay, there we go, yeah, the battery cannons, which we should be able to tear up relatively well, right? Come on, come on, come on. Excellent. Got it. Does that not give me any experience? Wow, that's sort of a shame. They got a whole party of them coming up. You know what, I think it's time to uh, start working on this. We got ourselves our, geez, they're still attacking me like crazy though. Still attacking me like crazy. Got all these Legion Drakes. Come on, come on, come on. You can't get me, you can't get me. I might just wanna fly around for a little bit, see if we can't get our, our health back like that. Okay, we're getting it back, so I'm gonna start working on this again. Looks like my teammates were able to help with some of the ships that were attacking us. If I can keep working on the battery cannons, I feel like that'll be our best bet. So you better believe that's what I'll try for. It's these huge clusters of guys, though, that are making it a little bit more difficult. Okay, come on, come on. Come on. Oh boy. Just nice. The first course. I've got my eye on you, Starlink. Okay, everyone. The laser oh. turrets are coming online. Take them out. 
Okay, first I gotta get this whole cluster of guys up this way. We're doing pretty good. Oh boy, so yeah, the Dreadnought's one third of the way down. That's a good sign. Because if we can tackle this one, there's another Dreadnought that should be the same level. And that'll be very good. Okay, hold on, where'd you go? Get back here. Targets come on, come destroyed. on, come on. Got it. Turret's destroyed, oh thank you. Get this dude. So, Alliance shipment, <laughs> Electrum received, cool. Gotta get rid of some of these guys now if I can. There we go, tearing them up with that. So where in the world is the thing I'm trying to focus on here? I think it's down this way. Oh, is it these? I forget how this works. But yeah, something opens up. Yeah, these things. Okay, yeah, we gotta do the dread eyes. Got it, almost done. Oh, but we can't hit it when it's attacking us. Is that the idea? Looks like it. I remember this now. I just gotta back up a little bit. There we go, get it again, get it again, get it again, get it again. Nice, I need to dodge. Oh gosh, they're everywhere. They're everywhere, they're everywhere. Teammates, where are you? <laughs> I need to, I need a Starlink to show up here and help me out a little bit. That'd be appreciated. Come on, just get away. Oh, come on. What just happened? What just happened? No, I was pressing buttons to do the shield and send me back to the Equinox. Are you serious? Oh, that's so uncool. I was pressing them on the shield and in, the, the X button is also what sends you back to the Equinox once you get taken out. No, do I have to do it all over? Incoming that would be the worst. Travel. I think I do though. Oh, I'm so upset right now. All right, well now I have this giant bee swarm of different guys, of different Legion Drakes running around here that I gotta take care of first. Okay, dodging that as much as I can. Oh my gosh. None of these guys aren't even moving. They're just like sitting there attacking me. They have the ability to because there's like 70 of them and like one of me. Come on, where'd they go? Where'd they go? I gotta get rid of these guys first. Like it's just sort of a matter of fact, unfortunately. <laughs> They're destroying my ship right now. Come on, get rid of this dude. He's almost down, he's almost yep, down. Got him. I'm good. Okay, good job, Shade. Got it, so now we can start working on the Eyeballs of Doom, which there's one over this way. I don't know if that's actually doing any damage right now. Oh, it is, cool. Okay, back it up a little bit. And the second it goes, I'm gonna go. Awesome, that thing is going down real fast. Or no, it's not. Come on, start working on this one then. Okay, cancel it. So I can start charging up again. And we're gonna go again. And I'm healing, so it'd be good not to take any damage for a little bit. Got it, sweet. So there's one down. And that's when a whole nother swarm of them shows up. So I need to start dodging and just work on it. Got them. And I know they're gonna be shooting at me like crazy, so you just gotta keep moving. Jeez, is it tough or what? <laughs> Come on. Got it. And get this dude as well. Oh boy, oh boy. Nice. Oh gosh, no, 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 no. Okay, no, 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 don't, don't respond at the Equinox, that would stink. I don't know what my health is for this one right now. Okay, it's back to full. So like the second this thing is about to get taken out, I just need to switch ships. I need to really pay attention to it. With that being said, it's about to again. No, no, come on! Oh my gosh, that's the worst. It is the worst of all time. Jeez, I can't believe the game works that way sometimes. Like not even like a second, not even a second of like invincibility frames to figure out where you are and what's happening. Not a second. Like how uncool is that? Come on, come on. Go ahead and get rid of this dude. Got it. Okay, so I'm gonna storm over here and you guys are gonna feel the full extent of my wrath because I got plenty of it right now. Gone, see ya. Gotta destroy this one before it destroys me because it will. There it goes. Oh, and then they have 70,000 guys back over here. Oh my gosh, it is the worst. Because it doesn't make any sense why or how it works that way, you know? I don't know, total baloney to me. Uh, we'll try this thing. And then I might as well turn these into blues and not greens. And I've been needing to do that for like a number of them. I'm not even gonna read them right now. I just need to be able to go with it and just keep moving. It's the worst though, because it doesn't even feel challenging, it just feels absurd. Come on, keep going, keep going. And the faster you distance yourself away from all of it, the better it gets. Boosters recharged. But you can't like just ignore them and focus on the thing. It won't work most of the time. Like maybe if I do my special ability it will. Like that'll definitely help. When it actually gives me the chance to attack that is, it's the worst though. 
still like definitely the worst. But I can at least like indefinitely like spin around and indefinitely use my weapons. I don't know what's happening. Stop. Oh no. Oh boy. Come on, can I get it? I can't get it. It's about to end though. Which is a shame. Come on, come on. Got it. I only got a couple more of these guys to deal with. I don't know what our teammates are doing. It doesn't seem like it's dealing with these things. Oh my gosh, I don't want to do that. <laughs> ah, it keeps doing that to me. It's driving me insane. Come on, come on. And it just doesn't really receive much damage when it's actually shooting. Okay, go for it. Come on. Got it. So there's one more left. Have you guys seriously not gotten rid of this guy? Can I, can't you guys help me with anything? Okay, so there's only this one. So we just have to wait for it to show up. Come on. Right? Has to be. Uh, hello? Knock, knock. I hear a noise. Very weird noise. Like an electrocution kind of noise. Maybe it's on the other side. Or maybe it's glitched. No, it's on the side. Weird, why is it on the side? I mean, I guess my teammates must have gotten rid of these ones? Well, I guess my teammates have been helpful then. Sorry I complained. So when it's shooting like that, yeah, there's like a point where it closes. Come on. This is the only thing we have to worry about right now. Hmm. Luckily, there's a finite sure. amount of enemies. I guess I'll give you that. But you can't dodge me forever. Missiles incoming. That launcher is our way in. So we can beat up some of these missiles without too much of an issue, right? I would sure hope so. Because if not, I'm not gonna be able to survive this and I'll have to do it all over again. Because once you, like, when you have to go back, you do have to do it over. I don't know if I mentioned that. It's not fun. Okay, there's more missiles coming out. Ow. Uh, I might just wanna pull up my shield and just go in. Or does that, that's not how it works. Oh, that's not how it works. Okay, back it up. Warning incoming missiles. I've noticed that part. Don't you worry. You know, let's go ahead and just do this. There we go. <laughs> All I had to do was actually just attack it. So now we can finally go into it. Can we do it? Entry is now possible. I sure hope so. Okay, we got it. So now I can storm through this a little bit easier. You won't be staying long. She sounds so confident for somebody who just got all of her defenses destroyed. Gotta be honest, like that's one thing, is that she seems to be pretty good in tense situations. Our enemy, that is. And Chase seems fine. Oh, there's still more. Plenty more. Okay, I'm gonna go this way. How close are we? Guess not close enough. There's still more lasers to dodge. So this is a spy movie. Come on, keep going, keep going. There's still more, oh my gosh. Whoa. Not doing a very good job of dodging right now, I gotta be honest. Can I heal back up, please? I'm sure it will in a moment. Whoa, oh, come on, it's actually tough to see. Be... We'll have to see about that, and I can't use, oh yeah, that's right, I can't use my abilities here. So that actually might be tough. Last time we were in one of these was a real challenge. We got, it took a lot of work. We got real lucky, we didn't like take any damage though. I don't know if that's gonna work out here this time though. I don't trust it. Oh, it's scary. Come on, keep going. Keep going. Come on, dodge it. And then, ooh, just barely. Keep going, we got it. Oh no, oh boy. That worked, it's almost down. It's almost down. Just gotta keep going. Okay, we're fine, we're fine. Even if I took damage there, it's okay. I mean, I dodged most of them, don't you worry. All right, so we did it, we destroyed it. And we got the support ammo five, new mod collected. Very awesome. So how do we get out of here? This way? Um, I do not want to explode in here, so where's the exit? Must be this one. Yeah, it is, okay. Come on, let's go, quickly. Oh, before this thing explodes, I have to do it all over again, again. All right, so a dread not destroyed. Hopefully that makes things easier. I can only imagine, but you never know. Victory over Dreadnought, all pilots gain one skill point. That is awesome. So let's take a look at our skill points right now. We have two available for Razor, or not Razor. I don't know why I keep calling her Razor, this is Chase. Um, we can do plus 30% critical damage, plus 20 speed, boost gauge cost. I wanna do that one. Energy per trick. Uh, I could keep saving up for that one. I'll do this one. There we go. Pretty cool. 
So now that we've done that, we could work on another Dreadnought, and I'm tempted to. I think it actually might be our best bet. Okay. Hmm. It looks like there is a 100% alliance benefit. Like for Haven, it's build workshops from 0% alliance on any planet. Oh, that's very cool. And then here it's a 100% alliance be benefit, Legion Vision. So that can be really good when we have that. And then here it's a 0 0.5 times outpost cost in Atlas and Atlas. That's actually pretty good too. So we gotta work on that kind of stuff soon. But now hopefully this stuff gets a lot easier because the primes won't be here anymore. So we could go back here and try to work on it a little bit. That might be our best bet, because this is 20 to 30. That's not happening anytime soon. So we could try, I know we've seen a lot of Haven recently, but we're gonna see a lot more, because I think now with the, the lack of risk of Primes reappearing, we could get rid of them, and it won't be that bad of a big of a deal. I can really only hope. But yeah, we'll give it a shot. We'll see what ends up happening. Okay, let's charge up and go. Hyperdrive ready, go for it. Yeah. Okay, so let's get to the Haven and we'll try to, I mean, I don't know. I might want to just go right for the dude, but I don't know if that's going to be a good idea. Made it to Haven in record time. Yeah. The Legion has lots of work to do if it intends to claim this world. Okay, so the closest outpost is actually quite far away. Where's the closest active? The Prime's right here. It's actually pretty, pretty far from most, uh, Extractor, so like that's a good option for us. So I think I'm gonna go for that. I do need to heal first. So we're gonna work on that. And then we'll see what we can do. But I'm glad we're able to get rid of a dreadnought without too much of an issue. So I wanna go here. I'll just go to the lab. And we'll get that done. I'm going the wrong way though. Warning. Hold on, fly. Ow. Corruption detected. I know, but Side I have a couple of seconds. Go, go, go. That's all I wanted. I wanted to get out of the actual area. Oh, ow. <laughs> Come on, keep going, keep going. Not too far away. But we might actually be able to do this, and it should be easier to stay ahead if we can. Okay, so we got a mod ship in, in 15, 14 minutes. That's pretty good. So I need to interact with this, I need to talk to you. Oh, and we're here. going to Working repair, and that's all I really want to worry about for right now. So, go that way. Very cool. Like yeah. Okay, so where is this dude? I think we can handle this. I can only hope. Ooh, I'm a bit nervous. So it's doing something. But this is an arc prime, so it's not as powerful as some of the other ones that we've run into. Let's go ahead and damage it right now if I can. It'll let me. A tiny bit of damage. Okay, let's get to it. What are you gonna do, huh? Huh? What you want? Oh boy, go for him, go for him, go for him. And there we go, he busted his arm. He's not spawning in any reinforcements yet, so this is an excellent opportunity. I'm doing it, don't you worry. So I should be able to get through this first phase without too much of an issue. I might need more than one like attempt at his, yeah, at his thing, but I wanna save our ability for the second phase because that's when he runs to an extractor and like if it's anything like a couple episodes ago, he just like makes a force field that I can't do anything about. Oh, here they come. Legion reinforcements incoming. I know, you said that already. So, I mean, I could try to avoid it. I don't think that's a good idea. I think it's gonna, gonna be better to just focus firing. down these guys. Where the ice giant cow? I have no clue. He just, he went over there for some Vigilante reason. Squadron here. We took out an extractor. It oh, great. Stand a chance. That's awesome. Awesome to see that they can actually get rid of an extractor at this high of a level, you know? Okay, I gotta dodge it. I gotta dodge it, gotta dodge it. There we go. Come on, Ice Giant's almost down. He's down. Move over to this dude now. Pick up one of your little arms. Do it. See what happens. Come on. Don't got all day here. There it is. Okay, so I should be able to finish this off no problem. Got it. And easy. So now you're gonna try running away, and I'm gonna follow you through and through. Don't let it escape. I'm not going to. I'm gonna run to an extractor, unfortunately. But it's this one, this one's dead. Can I just attack it? I mean, it's it's gonna expose its belly, right? Or it's like tail or something. Last time this happened, oh, I need to break these crystals. That's what I gotta do. So I'm gonna try doing that. Maybe that's what I missed out on before. Okay, come on. He's not very happy about it. 
But that's not my concern. Okay, keep going, keep going, keep going. Nice. Oh, <laughs> we got Electrum, yeah! <laughs> that's the true victory here. Okay, midsection it is. We should be able to get this done real fast. Real fast because we just have an infinite ammo. Awesome. There we go, another pretty easy prime to take down. And we got minus 82% apparently. Alliance levels up. So that is awesome as you can see. Oh, that makes everything so much easier. Any stronger, Haven's life would have been in jeopardy. You made sure this world is safe. Indeed we did. So we're gonna snag this thing. We're gonna have to bring it somewhere worthwhile, which we have loads of options now. So that's awesome. Um, I probably will try to go to one, like this one over here. And so build workshops from, I mean, it says maximum aligned. Oh, okay, now we're at 100. Very cool. So it looks like a 2,000 experience for that one. That's a lot. Very good. And we get some uh, pretty cool stuff. There's some super rares. Fusion corruption detected on nearby fauna. Oh, I can't help you right now. I'm sorry. Got to keep going this way. But yeah, now that we've gotten 100%, we had that bonus now, so that's really exciting. I don't remember what it is at the moment. We'll check soon enough. For right now, I just want to cash this in, and I want to use it at a spot that could actually benefit from it. So it's gonna be very hard for the Legion to make progress now that we've done that. And that's what I was looking to do. So I probably, you know, had my priorities a little messed up. I didn't really know how to properly tackle it, but now I do. So that helps out a lot. So like if I want to play a new character, I should be able to go through this planet a lot easier now. I probably want to still focus on most of today's episode getting rid of any kind of extractors because they should still be pretty easy to handle. But for right now, I can go over this way, destroy whatever jerks are here because we still are gonna have to deal with an abundance of these guys. It's just gonna have to happen. Come on, get rid of him, get rid of him. Pretty cool, pretty cool. And then, Ice Giant, you're going down, buddy. Whoa, whoa, I jumped over both of those? No, I didn't. I was hoping I could, but I didn't. You know what? If I have this, I might as well use it. What are you gonna do, buddy? That, oh, that was pretty good. Good move. Got it. Okay, turning around to this. You're going down, dude, if I can, if I have anything to say about it. Oh boy, oh boy, come on, come on, come on. Got it. Okay, so unfortunately they did destroy this. Oh, that's, I really didn't want them to do that, but they did. That's not good. How are we doing with stuff here? I mean, that was our second lab that they just destroyed. Now we're only down to one. So that's not good at all. We're gonna have to rebuild that. Uh, let's open that and get the rebuilding, which means we also have to spend Nova, which really stinks. Uh, can I? I can't, I don't have the option right now. Four items, armory, workshop. Oh, am I getting that confused? Yeah, oh, you know what? It's usually five options. The thing is, this is that we already have business. that. It's Fresh the uh, Equinox thing. Okay, so we got that going on. We'll upgrade it, we'll deposit this Prime Core. That'll be helpful. Might even give us some Nova. Alliance maximized. Welcome back. Been a while. Uh, that's a little item. It gives five you. Nova, wowie. Energy unit of a Legion Prime? How did you get this? Thank you so much. We got up by defeating him. So there we go. That was pretty good. Is he at max level now? No. So we could keep delivering. Not the most helpful thing to do though. Uh so yeah, no ships to repair, that is awesome. You're good to go. I could pick up some of this Nova. I want to see if we can't get this to max level. Nova samples. Yep. Oh, there we this go. stuff makes for great elemental shields. Here, let me power you up. Reminder, All right. This analyzer can be used I don't need more reminders, features. I promise. Workshops. Okay. Deliver item. Bring it here. Let's see what data you collected. I, I didn't <sighs> collect much this data. This is powerful stuff. Here, let me use this element to outfit. Like I don't think this analyzer's half empty. Get back yeah. out there and scan some more critters. <laughs> uh, I'm not gonna do this that right analyzer's now. Half empty. I know, Get I heard it the first time. Everybody's crazy in this game. Oh my gosh. So yeah, what other things can we do? I think that it's gonna be smarter to focus on these. So that's what I'm gonna do. All right, so there's an extractor over this way. We'll try to spend you know, a good chunk of today's episode right now. Also, have I ever, yeah, I've definitely gotten quill heart pellets. I'll try to spend the rest of today's episode at the least. Oh, the thing isn't showing up. That is weird. Um. Never mind. That was broken. Proximity um, alert. 
Extractor detected. Power yeah, we're gonna take out as many extractors as possible. If you destroy it, Whoa. We can follow the chains oh, hey. Of other <laughs> okay, this is bad. But hey, they, these guys don't have the defense with them, so that's pretty good. They haven't really noticed me yet, so this is my chance to take them out. I'm also going to grab this thing. Oh boy. Oh gosh, that's a lot of stuff. You know what, let's go ahead. Yeah, get, kick in the overdrive real fast. There we go. Ooh, that's doing a ton of damage. Why is this like destroying them now all of a sudden? Oh, come on. Well, there goes my fun. I don't know why we were doing so well there. That was odd. There goes my overdrive as well. We'll just keep working on stuff. Oh gosh. I mean, it might just be the Dreadnought and the Prime being gone. These guys aren't as strong. There's so many of them. Oh my gosh. Keep dodging, keep dodging, keep going, keep going. Get rid of this dude. Ooh, just gotta keep working. Just gotta, ow, keep working. Ship efficiency improved. Ooh, nice, okay. So we gotta level up for this ship, which means we get a skill point. That'll be very useful to have. No, 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 no. Watch it. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, that's it. That's it, destroy him. That's enough to take him down. I've got a probe right in front of my face. Gotta destroy it. There's like so much happening. I need to get rid of the negative dudes. They have such an issue with me. I have an issue with them because we get frozen, we get stuck in here. There's not too much we can do about it. So we need to get rid of these guys. So let's try that out. And we just like demolish them right now. It used to not be that way. So I don't know what major thing changed there. Reinforcements incoming. Okay, so that's not good. We are not Legion. Oh, and we're demolishing these things real easy too. Okay, come on, get him, get him, get him. Go in this weapon as well. There's so much happening on the screen. Oh my gosh, get me out of here. Thank you. Come on, got it. Keep moving, we're not done. Got it. I don't see too many other enemies except for little imps, which really shouldn't be a problem. Oh, because this dude's out here. He's been the issue. Okay, go for it. See, now it's not as effective, for sure. I guess the big thing is that it has a pretty slow fire rate, but with our special ability, usually, it's not that big, like, you know, like, that kind of thing is not that big of a deal. Come on, get rid of this thing, too. Check your star map for more detail. Okay, we still have to destroy this thing and all its nodes. Is it still creating stuff? Can you please stop doing that? I think we just need to destroy it now because it keeps spawning in too many friends. Ooh, I know, I got it. Oh gosh. We should be able to destroy it, no problem here. Got it. Yeah, it just goes crazy critical. We gotta get that weapon a good set of mods. All right, well, Legion is pushed back here. Look at all the legendary mod chests we got. Not even legendary, they're just super rare. All right, so what, what do we get efficiency improve it, improvement with? It looks like the uh, the fire weapon. Cool. So there's two more uh, skill points we can use, right? Yep, two available. I'm gonna go ahead and just, hmm. Do these, yep. And then we'll worry about that stuff soon and then that eventually. Just trying to get her maxed out really because that means that she has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten more levels she can gain. So there's plenty of levels to gain. Not really too much to worry about there. Okay. So yeah, let's take a look at the Levitator, which is over this way. What kind of mods can we throw in this bad boy? Ooh, we got the support ammo five. Like, what do we have right now? We have the commander ammo three, 35% damage, 50 fire rate, deal damage to charge energy. Instead we could do this, which is plus 30% damage, plus 20% damage to targets within 50 meters, and then plus 100% projectile bounds, heals for 1% damage done. That's something. We already have a legendary there. And I don't know if I could actually replace this with something better. That could be good right there. We'll try that out. It's pretty far from another level up but it's still doing pretty well. All right, look at all this stuff, wowie. So I can grab that. I wish there was an upgrade that would make it so that you can stash Nova instead of having to carry it. I mean, maybe there is, but I don't think so. That'd be so good. That'd make it so much easier. I'd be so happy about that. Even if it was really expensive to get to, it'd be well worth it. I need to make sure we get the, the core of the uh, extractor as well, which is over this way. Unless I've already grabbed it. Might have already grabbed it. Okay, never mind. So we're gonna grab that. And what is, 
We haven't gotten that one? I suppose not. So I'll work on it now. Probably should grab this stuff too on our way over. Oh, oh, oh. Nice. Where is this stuff? Open that. And open this. Reminder. Oh no, hold on. Corrupted I don't need a reminder. Like this are a valuable resource. So at this rate, we're doing pretty good on most things. I just, I mean, I don't even need more defense stations, I think. Like, we could just do another observatory because it's real cheap. I don't even have to do too much to get like the percentage up. I just want to create one. I mean, do I though? I mean, it just makes it for those more drop-off stations, which can always be good. So I guess we're going to this one instead. <laughs> right here. Okay, whoa! Ah! Ah! Okay. No, I don't want to swap it for an analyzer. Okay, observatory, real cheap. Observatory systems live. Come collaborate with us when you're ready. Oh, I'm I see ready. You're carrying some cores with you. We'd be happy to purchase some if you're selling. I am not selling it to you. Unfortunately, it's nothing against you. Welcome, welcome. Out but, there enjoying the wonders of Atlas, I trust? I'm trying to. I can give you this Nova core if you want it. Cuz if I talk to you, deliver item, gives me a common gravity mod. This kind of stuff gives me common mods. The pellets give me nothing. Okay, I mean, is it worth it? Yeah, I'm not gonna Why, give it to anybody what an else. Unexpected gesture. I appreciate the gift, friend. Increase my visibility, but I don't need it. We'll repair our damaged ships and move on with that. So what other uh, things we got? We got this one, we got quite a few. There's still eight of them left to take down. Like that's gonna be a lot of busy work, but it's gonna be worth doing. That way when we play with weaker characters, they can just focus on what actually matters and that's really good. Okay, so flying over all this stuff. And we should be able to work on this extractor. Oh boy, we're coming in for landing. This one actually seems real simple. Like, yeah, there's no enemies here yet. Emphasis on yet. Ooh, that tore it up, that tore it up. Yeah, when did this weapon suddenly get so good? I swear I've used it plenty of times in the past. It was not this good, but now it is. I mean, I'm not complaining. I love to have a good, reliable weapon. Proximity alert. Extractor detected. I know, I'm right next to it. There we go. Or our allies will be in serious danger. Okay, come on. Got it. So now we can turn around and start working on this thing. Kicking into overdrive. And whenever it lowers, or is it lowered? Oh, there's still one more. Oh, never mind. Oh, that was such a waste. Whoopsies, I didn't see this thing. All right, I probably could have kept the overdrive going on and I would have ended up getting, you know, both this guy and the other thing taken out, but I don't need it. There we go, okay. Note to self, don't use it unless you can actually see it. There we go. So will we be able to get rid of it? I think so. I don't know, it's gonna be close. Got it, not a problem. So there's another extractor done. Ancient extractor destroyed. Legion pushed back, he can't be pushed back any farther than 0%. Extractor destroyed. So I can't wait to use I these spoke. cores on a different We've area. The location of the extractor that was linked to this one. Marking on your map now. Okay, so it just makes it easier to find more of them though, which is great. So I might just leave those open spots up for later on. Those open spots for uh, building refineries and stuff. Just might be smarter. So this one really shouldn't be so bad. And we get such good experience for it too. I mean, for the level we are, if we were doing it with a lower level thing, like it wouldn't really work out so well because it would just Our take so much time. Allies have delivered a shipment of enhancements. Kicking into overdrive. So I don't know why this guy's already damaged, but I will gladly take it. Okay, this guy should be taken down real easy. Yeah, these guys, somebody must have, well, I mean, I guess there was already these guys fighting here. Yeah, I'm using fire against fire there. I was gonna use this for now. It just makes it easier. Got it, and then he has a friend over there. Oh, hello. Hello, taking you down. Not a problem. It's easy now again. Oh, it makes me so happy. There we go. Okay, we got it. Well, there's still another fire giant over this way. I'm gonna switch over to this real fast. No, probably not the most effective thing to do. So why should I do it? I should do this instead. There we go. And that should tear him up. All right, awesome. And with that, yeah, this thing doesn't even have any nodes. It was just those guys protecting it. Well, this is the flamethrower. I don't know if I want that as much as I want this. You know, it is very close to a level up, so maybe I'll keep it for now. If it's working, oh, look at this. It's a like crazy close range damage. That's actually pretty cool. Okay, so ancient distractor destroyed, lesion is pushed back even farther. And we got tons of chests to open. I'm gonna bust that thing out of there. So we're at 17 Nova before. Gain some experience, of course. 
And hopefully this gets up some more Nova as well. Sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. We're about to find out. Uh, not that time. Oh no, it gave us one, that's good. Oh, there's so many chests. And a ton of guys to repair. All right, I'll repair all of you. Every single one of you is busted. Do they repair each other at all? I, could chew there. Much obliged, I think they friend. do. Maybe they don't. <laughs> they just watch each other suffer. Jeez, they are all just busted. I mean, we're getting some decent experience morning. for it. We're getting multipliers for it too. That's weird. Extractor. Got it. And I can't believe they can take ex down extractors on their own though. Like, how awesome is that? <sighs> bit off a bit more than I could chew there. Much obliged, friend. Okay, that's all of them. So I can grab these chests, like this one and this one. Don't forget this one. That's sort of the big benefit to this, is you just get so many mods, almost too many mods. Like what am I supposed to do with all these things? We can make so many legendaries if we get more Nova. So we just gotta keep getting more Nova. And we're at 18 so far. So where's the next one? We have three, oh wow, only three. It's pretty good. Where's the next extractor at? Gonna be somewhere around here. There it is. So, I don't know where we are though. Let's teleport to here. I think that'll make us a little bit closer. I did see two of them right there. So that'll make it easier. Get rid of those guys and we'll be good. All right, so we just got some Electrum. About 100, almost 200,000 of us. That's pretty good. But we are almost there. And I know where the other two extractors are. They're not too far off from here. So that'll be pretty good. Looks like outlaws are actually fighting it too. Gonna have to get rid of both of these guys then. There we go. Oh boy, this is a lot. This is a lot. I'm gonna go into super mode already. Yeah, some of these guys have already taken some good damage. Threats like this, we better take action. Okay, so I need to switch. Uh, we're gonna switch to this. There we go. Real fast, just take this guy out, and then switch back to the flamethrower. I think. There we go. This guy's still kicking. No, he's just still getting taken out. <laughs> How crazy is that? Okay, got that thing down. Is that the last one? I don't think so. No, there's more. There's definitely more. Come on, come on. Got it, so we got like some crazy close range damage with all this, for sure. So I don't have my super special, I don't I don't need it. I don't need it. All right, come on, a little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more, we got it. It's down. Wowee. We got a super tall tree in the background. We should probably, uh, maybe I won't. I wanted to check out the uh, thing for this area. Or what's it called? Destroyed. Um, is that nearby? Is that what that big tree is? I suppose not. You know, everything has one wonder. Every planet has one wonder to it. But I wanna check that out later, I suppose. So let me help all of you guys out in a second. Might as well get my one Nova first. And then I will repair you. It's some pretty easy experience for it. And there's like four of them to get. There. Much obliged, friend. If we can get the multiplier, that is. Did we get it there? Hard to tell. Almost a level up for this weapon. Oh, did we get it? Skill point gained. Nice with the flamethrower. Very good. We're about to get a little bit more too. <sighs> bit off a bit more than I could chew there. Much obliged, friend. No problem. Reminder. Corrupted okay, everybody's talking at us. Open these up. It will fetch a high price at any outpost. Okay, so we got a couple more cores there. I do want to take a look at our loadout. Now that I can choose some other stuff. What's the closest to a level up? Looking at the ice barrage weapons. I suppose so. A little bit of that, but doesn't help me too much. This is the closest thing though. I'll try using that, but I can't use it against ice guys is the only problem. Okay, so now that we've done that, there is two more extractors. I thought that they were pretty close. There's one right here, and then there's another one, I think along the planet somewhere. We'll find it. For right now, we can get to this one. We might as well work on it. We're making good progress in today's episode. I'm happy with it, for sure. So we're just gonna keep moving and hope we can continue making that progress. Because at this rate, we're pretty well set up to actually come here with a character we're less familiar with and get some good things completed. Fauna. Okay, so we're gonna work on this. And that's really what my goal is in these kind of episodes, is just basically prepare the planet so that they're a little bit easier to go through and get everything completed. Because that can be a bit of a challenge at times, for sure. Okay, so almost there at this one. There's a lot of giant trees on this planet. I really like it. This is more like a giant mushroom, as it looks like it to me. Ooh, big jumps. Big jumps, ooh, that sort of hurt. But this one doesn't look like it could be too bad. 
We'll work on all the non-ice guys first and see how that ends up working out. And then after that, we'll switch over out of the ice extractor. Not the ice extractor, what am I talking about? The ice uh, missiles out into something else. There we go. Anybody else? There's this probe. Work on the probe. The probe is gone. Okay, switch to this. Where is he? He's over this way. I can't even tell what's going on. Oh my gosh, there's this explosions all up in my face. Come on, come on. I can't tell what's going on. I think we got it. I think we're fine. Got it. Okay, we're good, we're good. Is that all the enemies down though? It is, except for this one imp. Okay, cool. I mean, that might mean that there's actually, oh, there is one more left. Oh, you're still here. Dude, get out of here. Okay, then, oh, oh, this is ready, this is ready. Come on, we can destroy it. No problem, just like last time. Easy, easy, easy. Got it. So there is like our eighth distract or extractor, not distractor, done in today's episode, and we still got one more to go. And we got a couple more guys to help. Recharged. We did good. We did very good. So, I'm gonna pluck this. And I'm gonna help you out. Repair. And I think his friend needs help as well. Oh, come on. Got it. <sighs> bit off a bit more than I could chew there. Much obliged, friend. Got this one as well. No, I would never have made it without your help. Thank you, friend. <laughs> I love the voice acting on some of them. That's sort of the thing. Voice acting in this game is not bad. It just gets exhausting because one thing, the robot lady, it re-explains the same things over and over again indefinitely. And then everybody else has the same voice. Like the other guys, like all the, all the other people have the same voice. And it just like, or at least there's like two separate voices. And like, that's just not very interesting to listen to. Okay, come on. I just gotta beat him up with this. Come on, come on. Did I get it? You know, I'm gonna switch over to this weapon. We'll make it easier, because these guys are all heat dudes. Um, I probably shouldn't have done that. I didn't really mean to. I was trying to drop the thing I had. Got it. Yeah, these guys are all fire. So we can keep using these ice missiles like nobody's business. Act successful. So, move over to this one. Open that chest and it's looking good to go. So one last extractor somewhere on this planet, trying to find it. There it is. So it's here. Where's the closest teleport spot? Not anywhere nearby. <laughs> All right, well, I just have to go there the long way then. Okay, that there really isn't too many spires to teleport to around here. I think I just gotta fly over there for the most part. Okay, so here we are. Oh, it's already open? Why is it already open? Will it close? Uh, well, we're just gonna take it out real fast. Oh, there it goes. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Thought I was gonna get some easy situations there. All right, let me get rid of all the fire giants as fast as I can. That weapon's doing the trick. I know it is. Don't worry, Mason. And then I got rid of that guy too. Oh, we're good. We're good. We're good. Take this thing out. Take this thing out. I might switch though to this real fast. Yeah, it didn't really matter. <laughs> okay, awesome. Uh, you know what? I don't know if this will actually work, but if I can get some easy experience with this one, that'd be pretty good as well. All right, so that should be every single extractor destroyed. It looks like there's still a guy over there. Is he exploding or what? Yeah, he's exploding. We're fine, we're fine. Very cool. So let's go ahead and snag this thing. And this, all these. Wait, did I just start hacking something? I don't think I did. Okay, we're good. Oh my gosh, so every single extractor on this planet is gone. And without the dreadnought, I don't see how they can start coming back. And that's, that's sort of a problem for that one over there. But now we can you know, go onto this planet, take care of that one's extractor, that wouldn't be too bad. We do have a little bit of time left in today's episode. Like I don't think it's worth getting rid of these primes if we have this guy to worry about, you know? And that's gonna be tough. That's sort of like a little bit later down the line. 28 to 30 level recommendation is insane. But at this rate, that's fantastic. The progress we've made with all this, as you can see. I'm very happy with it. So I think at this point, like as you can see, build workshops from 0% Alliance on any planet. Like that's pretty huge. So if we wanna to go to a planet that isn't doing so well, we do have some chances to work with it. I definitely think we need to take on that Dreadnought soon enough. Like maybe that'd be a proper way to finish off today's episode. Let's go for it. We're gonna do one more Dreadnought battle. Hopefully it turns out okay. And then we'll be done for today's episode. Okay, so here we are. I wanna go ahead and get around. This is a Shar that we're right next to, but I'm gonna ignore that and go around it. We still have a while to go to actually get to that Dreadnought. It's a little slow at the moment. That, that's just because we're sort of fighting the planet's atmosphere, I think. So maybe if we actually go a little to the left and then go to the right, that might be smarter. Yeah, it's not really going the way I want it to for right now, but it, it will in a moment. 
But yeah, honestly, I'm actually happy with the progress we made in today's episode. Being able to completely clear out Haven, we'll have to wait and see if a Prime will show up or if another Dreadnought will take its place. Hopefully we have a good couple of days in game or something, just like a really long time before another Dreadnought shows up though, because that makes it so much tough to keep up or so tough to keep up with everything. Like, I have no idea how it's possible to have 100% alliance on all planets at the same time with how much it fights you with that. Um, unless the Dreadnoughts actually stay away for a while and that's what we're gonna find out. So usually the closer we get to these kind of things, the, the, the more speedy it will get, so like, over time. We're still sort of fighting the atmosphere of the uh, Ashar, I think. But yeah, there are plenty upon us to explore and to go through. You guys will have to let me know if you want to see more episodes. Okay. So yeah, there we go, now it's going way faster. Way faster as we make our way through this asteroid belt. Only a hundred thousand away now. Warning. Incoming yep, Elbow here come the traps. Trap. I was expecting it sooner or later. So where is it? Uh... You know, usually you point out the obvious, but this time, okay, never mind. Oh boy, got it. That wasn't too big of a deal. And I don't know if the second part of the trap is gonna show up or not, because we're so close to the dreadnought at this point. This thing is really far out here to, too. So, alert. there we go. Legion dreadnought. Hyperdrive disabled. Hopefully the rest of Starlink is nearby. Dreadnought defense is engaged. Prepare for battle. And there's also like, uh, the pirates, or what are they called? These guys right here. There's a lot of outlaw hideouts. We haven't done any of those. I think we might start doing those soon. Okay, let's go ahead and start working on these guys and do what we can. I definitely need to change this weapon. Um, I'm thinking we could just do this. Yeah, do our double up. We did this before, it worked. Take that. And start working on these guys as much as we can. And we have our favorite ship here. We'll keep working on it as much as we can. And see if our, our friends have showed up, which is a good thing. Of course. And they're all level 25, so this really should be the equal amount of difficulty as we had before. And if things start getting nasty, which it looks like they're about to, come on, I will shift over and use a different ship before this thing gets destroyed. Like, that'll be my main goal. Okay, here you are. You're the last dude, and we got you. So I wanna sort of storm through and see how many of these uh, things I can take out before the enemies get too crazy. That's sort of my hope. So it's gonna start shooting at me from here. So overdrive it is. Like, destroy this one and just turn and start focusing on the next one. It hit me right in the face, though. So. One cannon down. Another pa cannon to go right here. And then there, is that all of them? No, there's one more this way. And I know lots of bad guys are showing up at this point and they're not so happy with me. But there we go, we got it. Your assistant. I'll give you that. Okay, okay, there's a lot of them now, though, is the problem. Take them out. Maybe that wasn't the best idea ever. But I'll do what I can about this now. The laser turrets are doing what laser turrets do. We'll just have to ignore it for now as we destroy all these enemies because there's only a finite amount of enemies, which means, you know, just a limited amount. It doesn't come out indefinitely. We just gotta destroy all these guys, focus on the next objective, make progress in that objective, and then more guys will show up. This guy has some shields. We gotta focus on him for as long as I can. There we go. They definitely seem a bit tougher than the previous Dreadnought. Okay, there we go. Maybe they're on the higher end of that 20 to 25 level estimation. Come on, come on. Ooh, got it, turn over to this one. I don't know, at the same time, we're sur surviving a lot better. You know, by this point, I definitely had to switch uh, ships. But that doesn't mean that it won't get harder later on. And I also feel like I just know what I'm doing a little bit more. Cause that seems to be all of them. Which means I can Sort of just re-angle myself right now, and then turn around. Where is it? I don't know if that actually helped at all. So these things are attacking at the moment. Our teammates are also attacking, which is great. So I could get down there and just start working on them. And I'm farther than I thought. Okay, that sort of helped. Okay, where's the next one at? Right here. Try and keep up. Is that one's done? And that one's done. Easy, easy, okay. A fleet of them now. Oh my gosh. And I went right into the swarm. Didn't really have too much of a choice. Okay, couldn't really damage that one. I'm gonna move out this way as fast as I can, as much as I can, and then turn around and just destroy as many of them as possible. I don't know. No, 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 I hate it when it does that one. I'm just trying to dodge. It thinks I'm trying to go backwards. I'm be a bit sensitive. Come on, come on. Ooh. 
There we go. I think I've been getting my buttons confused. I've been holding the L for the ice and the R for the fire when it's vice versa right now. Got it. Okay. Oh, let's back it up. And then once I got some separation, I'm gonna turn around again. Just take these guys out. Like that would be nice. Got it. And your friend over here. Yeah, all the, the ones with the armor are the ones that survived. And there's one last dude over this way that I think we'll be able to take out, or at least our teammates can work on it. I would hope. It's another elite. Got him. Okay, so they're doing what they're do what they do best, which is be annoying. Okay, got it. Got it, and then can we damage this one at all? A little bit. Okay, let's cancel it, because more enemies are showing up, because a, a group of enemies show up every time you destroy one of the eyes, which honestly isn't that big of a deal. It's when you destroy two eyes at once, it gets real nasty, because there's just too many of them to handle. This time, oh, oh, the, the laser actually got me that time. That's uncommon. Oh, come on, come on, damage it. No, I couldn't really do too much damage before, too late. There's still two more of these things, but it wants me to get rid of this one. Like that one's just not popping up in the moment. Come on, oh. Come on, do it again, see what happens. There we go, it's done. So all of his teammates should be showing up soon. All the uh, bad guys. So the next one's on the other side. This one's just not opening. It is weird how it does that. There's only one on the other side. And then we'll just have its last bit of health where I gotta destroy it from the front. So I'm not gonna go super powered for this one. I wanna save it because we can't use it on the inside anyways, we might as well. There we go. This guy loses his temper about a lot more than the other lady. Okay, so we're doing this. We can, for the most part, dodge these as long as we can destroy the door, as far as I understand. If that's what really matters. Ow, oh, that, okay, I don't know what happened, that was weird. Okay, let's go in. We got it, I hope. We'll see about that. I mean, Grax is already taken down, so. <laughs> okay, keep going, keep going. Nice stuff. Whoa, whoa, let's slow it down a little bit. Put on the brakes. That's, okay, that's not the brakes. Okay, we should be fine. There's gonna be plenty of lasers to work our way through as per usual. Oh, I didn't even mean to flip like that there. Okay, go through that one. Oh, that was good, that was really clean. And, oh, this one might be a little bit more difficult. I just have to slow it down a little bit, got it. And going that way, ooh, that was good. Oh gosh. And then go through you like this. this. And then just attack this thing right away. Right away, just start blasting it. Okay, keep going. Where do you think you're going, sir? You ain't hiding from me. I really wish we could use our thing here, but we can't. Yep, our special ability. That is a shame but we'll be fine. It's almost down already, so as long as we keep up with it and not hit lasers too often, ow, like that. Come on, let's not be bad at the game. Let's not be bad at the game. Okay, come on, almost got it, almost got it, almost got it, almost got it, got it, nice! All right, where's the exit? Exit is, oh, we got another new mod, legendary. Units earned, dread nothing. Where, which one, where's the exit? Do I have to shoot one of these for the exit? I don't know how this works. Um. I don't see which one we leave, which is sort of concerning because they are all exploding and I need to get out of here before it explodes. What do I do? None of them are open. None of them are open. Am I missing it? Maybe it's below? What is happening? Oh, here we go. That definitely wasn't there before. But we got it now. Yeah! Get out of there! We did it! <laughs> awesome. So there is two Dreadnoughts defeated in one episode. How exciting is that? Victory over Dreadnought. All pilots gain one skill point. Very, very cool, which means there's only one more Dreadnought even taking on the skies. We'll have to deal with that very soon. That'll be very cool. Wow, and I guess, yeah, like trade sector hard. It used to not be that way. This is the uh, frontier sector, which is medium now. And this is the easy area. Why did it flip? That is very bizarre. Okay, so with that being said, very cool stuff. We're level 23 now as uh, Chase. I could, um, 
Might as well do this. Get some speed for our other teammates. That'll be amazing. But for now, that is going to wrap it up for today's episode of Starlink Battle for Atlas. If you watched this part of the video, make sure you comment Dreadnought Zebra. So you've watched at the end of the you are a Zebra Tastic viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now. Or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. By the way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.